these are the adventures of Patrick and Alexander. I have now taken my paternity leave. As you can hear, he is crying. He has just woken up. So let's go and see how he's doing. Hey, little dude. How you doing? You say hello to the world. Yeah. Time for a change. Another bottle. Okay. So Alexander, are you ready to come out and have a bit of an adventure today? We need to go and have some breakfast and we've got some chores to do, haven't we? Yeah? I believe it's time for Alexander's bottle. Which will take about 20 minutes or so. You really want that bottle, don't you? Yeah, it's on its way. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah, is that better? Galahad. Now Galahad's a little bit off his food at the moment, aren't you mate? The current wet food we've bought you. Would you like the dry food, so that's what you're eating? A nice full tummy as well? Is the only person who's not eating today me? I need to get some brunch, I want to get some fresh air. I have some things I want to do to set up the vlog. So I have to wear this sexy thing. So I'm going to put a minute, which will settle them down. Somebody's uh... A little bit burpy still. Aren't you? Now that I'm all, well, saddled up like a donkey, we need to take all the washing down and get it all cleaned up so that we have clean clothes. You comfortable? Snug as a bug? Ready for a big adventure? We're only doing the washing, but you know, never mind. Right, off we go. New galley. See you in a bit. I complained to the building staff about an incident yesterday and now I'm going to go to Eto and have my breakfast since the cat and Alexander's had his. We have to wear this because, well, look at today's beautiful weather. Gorgeous. It's like summer. It's still bloody hot though. Latte and a croissant. Chill out. It's nice and cool. Where's Frank? He went home. Frank's not home. Veto a little bit earlier than I originally had planned. Because <sighs> somebody has pooped right through his outfit, and we need to go home and kind of properly change him now. Oh well, still a nice breakfast at Eto. He's falling asleep in his own shit now. We'll go home and change him still. Nice and changed, and have a nice clean, a nice new clean outfit on, haven't we? Yeah. We're gonna do maybe some playtime for a little bit. Give him some tummy time. You're not ready to chase the cat yet, are you? You're getting hungry. Might soon be time for another bottle. No wonder he's getting chubby. You don't like chubby? Fat? Fatty boom boom? You're just gonna eat dust. Yeah, that's right, he's doing a baby diet. Dust. No, dust. No more milk, just dust. We may have to wait to play. Someone's decided to fall asleep. While he's asleep, that allows me to do things I need to do and want to do. First thing, I think I need a cup of tea. Galahad's a bit moody too. Galahad! Galahad! Very sleepy kitty. Hey! 
Somebody's woken up, haven't they? And am I right in thinking somebody's a little bit hungry? Are you hungry? Yeah. Come on. So this is bottle number three for today. Somebody has decided to grace us with his presence again, haven't they? So we're going to do some uh, a little bit of playtime with him. I'm going to quickly set that up now. I actually enjoy giving Alexander some tummy time. I feel it helps strengthen his, his core, his neck, his back. And he's under creep, which is a really good sign. So hopefully he'll soon be walking. And then we get him on the ice. All you. There we go. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Keep going. Yeah, come on. Push, push, push. Yeah, come on. Come on. What's up with those arms again? Yeah. Whee! That's it. Yeah. Where are you going? That's um, every hour that he's awake-ish. Just to help him develop. And then we put him on the play mat with lots of sensory learning and toys and feelings and colours and noises for him to play with and experience. Melissa has been at work, it's her first day back, I uh, mentioned that earlier. She's been a little bit upset, obviously she's missed him, so we thought we'd do a little surprise visit, didn't we? Oh, he's asleep again. <laughs> so I tried to find out where Melissa is, see if she's still actually at work, and she didn't sneak out early. She may have snuck out early. Nice to be seen. Remember who I am, yeah? Yeah? No! Baby mama happy? Sorry. You gonna hold him? Yeah. You go to Brian Park first? Yeah, let's do that. After Brian Park, we go. We've sent Melissa for water. It's stupidly hot today. Now I can't find Melissa. Oh, there she is. You happy? Sorry. It's a nice, quite like, hard day, a little bit easier. Yeah. It's not happen every day. Wow. Very successful park little visit with Alexander and myself and obviously Melissa tagged along and now we're going to take the train back home and chill out a bit, have some food, start again tomorrow. But day one's been a success. <laughs>